Hey there, Era and the Sao Cow playing Hyper 6. Uh, I think it's everyone agrees that as of now, this game has been a complete and other masterpiece. Every level was very fun, although there were flaws, you no, know, they were all things that were easy to work around. And, uh, like, I mean, the feedback I've had just about this game in general during this entire run has been fantastically positive, uh, to a point, like, I, I can't barely, like, just imagine, like, it's just, it's even hard to believe. Thing is, but when I just start with, no, before that, when I announced that I was gonna play this, people in the know, people who know about this game, told me that I would have a pretty alright positive time up until the World 8, and to be more precise, up until the level before World 8, until the World 7 Castle. We have now reached the World 7 Castle. Cool ass desert castle. So, everyone, this is when officially. Five stars. Officially, when I'm gonna stop having fun anymore. According to people who know what they're talking about. That's a cool dragon coin to get. So, there's this evil TV down there. There's multiple pathways. Well, I can go here. So let's just go and spend some time together with the family. Perfect. This has been played perfectly. Never before has such perfection been said. It's the most perfect way to say the word perfection. Uh, so yeah, I don't really know what to expect, but we got this beautiful Castlevania song. Oh, wow, that was just bad placement of me. Like, why did I just stand there? What did I think was gonna happen? But I hit all the switches and I'm ready to go. I guess the goal is to get a switch and this evil TV is gonna do something. Just out of curiosity, like, what's over here? We had a bit of an inkling of what's in the other here. Oh, oh what? Did that count? I disagree. There's a red pipe. But the other side had to switch with something. This, this door here. Oh, sweet. Uh. Alright, hey, I mean, I guess technically you can use this to farm power-ups in a really inefficient way. The hitboxes on these is way worse than I remember. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Uh, what's over here? Crazy little jump. Alright, then you're here. I'm like, yeah, coins? Yeah, coins are good. What's that platform? Okay, it's solid. Hey, Flum, what's going on? Do you have pay-per-view? I have no idea. Ah! Yeah, in any ways, there's nothing there. Um, alright. That looks kind of impossible. Master platform. So here you have to time yourself with all of this. Yeah, that seems like something that's gonna happen. But this is easy, this is easy, this is easier when you're small. Because you can just kind of wait for all the potabos to fly off the back door, which I've seen happen already. So, you know, no pressure here, and then you can just kind of go, Hey, check out this beautiful wall carpentry. It's carpet, but not wall, it's called wallpaper, idiot. No wallpaper in your carpet -tee. Oh, what? Oh, hi, this is terrible. Wow. Yeah, that's what I thought was gonna happen. <laughs> you go early, that's what you want to do. I want to go as early as you can. Don't wait. Don't wait. That, that particular combination of phonemes have brought me a lot of joy. There weren't any saws last time I was here. Where'd y'all go, saws? This changes a lot about this particular place. <laughs> Whoops. On purpose. Alright, so... So I guess you go to the very edge. Oh boy, this feels real special. For a time, that's, that's a lot of time. The most calculators don't get to be 100. I want to have some ways off here. So you can do a proper run under. Because otherwise, like, you need to kind of jump your way through it. And then that means you need to jump. Which, you know, spike ceiling. 
focusing on all the spikes. That's what I do. Yeah, you can't really spawn these out. Oh boy. I'm not sure how this is gonna work. Yeah, without jumping too high. Alright, so I'm big. I don't really know what that means. I guess it means I can take a hit. It could mean that. <laughs> It's my fault for not noticing. It was very obvious to notice the notice the notice. Pay your bills. I I don't know how you do that without getting hurt. I really, really don't. Alright, so Don't mess around! Alright, this is just can you can you turn quick? This one's there to trick you. Gotta wait a little bit. Alright, so far so good. Coins, awesome. There's this green flag mountain there. Also, pretty great. Oh, hey. Otherwise, they're doing kind of a blind uh, job on this little mystery here. Well, uh, hi, Potabo. Hi, Poison. Everyone's showing up to my birthday party. Alright. Just gonna not bounce on these. What am I looking at here? Like, are you expected to do a ha or is there a platform I'm not seeing? Um, no! There's not any platforms I'm not seeing. How doable is this jump? Um... Um... <laughs> Yeah, that's what I thought was gonna happen. Well, okay. The problem is that I didn't have any real momentum. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. I'm just, I think I'm just gonna always get hurt there. Just always get there big, and this guy here randomly won't spawn. <laughs> See, uh, with seeing things not spawn like that, though, like... Part of me wonders, well, is it just maybe a case that something that was supposed to spawn it didn't spawn? I mean, it's not impossible. Wait a second. From you. Dude, I'm an idiot! Why did I get the feather? <laughs> I was so preoccupied with survival, I didn't think of the obvious. Yep, yep. I mean, with a feather then, that part becomes significantly easier. Also, yeah. There was not a ball and chain that you could have used as a way to spin down across the pit. Oh, that, that makes me sad. That makes me a little bit mad. Like, I died in a stupid way, doesn't matter. Not related to the level. I have just a little, uh, that, <laughs> that the thing didn't spawn. I didn't know a thing didn't spawn, so I didn't think to make it respawn, you know? Like, I would have gone back a screen or two. To make it come back, but I didn't know a thing was missing. Oh uh, man. A thousand man in a thousand pits. You know what? We even smarter? Get the feather first. And then get the better power up from the box. Cow cow. Do that after you die. Do something dumb. Well, the ball is there again. Mr. Spear, but now that I got a cave, so I don't even need it. There's a saw! I- Hi! <laughs> Alright, there's a saw in there. Oh, wow, oh, well... Mm. Wow, everyone is hopping and I'm dead. 
Alright, so, do plan a cow, stop being dumb. Now, sometimes I, I, I just die by falling into stuff, so... I'm not saying it's gonna be of infinite help, but... Ah, oh, it's just a fireball. Well, I mean, fireball... Strictly speaking, is still better than just a mushroom. Like, there might be, like, a turtle or something at some point that I can... Hey, check out why that spike ball didn't spawn this time. Doesn't matter to me! Hey, Spike, how's it going? Alright, so... Having cape flight here... Let's you see the skeleton. Let's you mess up your timing. Let's you not get to the platform, question mark? Um... Alright. Crazy how you need to like give yourself momentum like that. As far as I can tell. Hey there, sweet, super enterable door. I know part of it's like, hmm, but is there anything beyond? Like, uh, I need to find out. I'm gonna get hit, right? Yep. This is the cost I pay to look around over there to see absolutely nothing. Losing. Oh, hey, there's a switch here. <laughs> I barely noticed that it was the switch. Really? Now that's. Tricky. Alright, well, next time, don't just check to see if there's anything below. I can just tank going in there and going in the door. So that's a switch, you can press, maybe you can go in the evil TV set. I don't know what the door over to the left does yet, but I figured, well, you know, I'm just following the logical chain of, hey, you can't go here after you press the switch. Ah, so of course this is where the switch would be. So everyone's like, hey, I don't want to look at I have no idea, man, how you do this part without getting hurt at all. Uh, well, uh, you know what? Let's just tank. Let's tank everything! So I get ejected back here. This thing is now open for public consumption, and I can touch it. The evil TV screen that leads to the middle of the level. Music is different, power up there is different, there's no dragon coin there, so I'm in a different screen. I can still touch it. And that leads me back to the first one. Okay. Fascinating. What does that mean? Uh, well, everything's a little bit different. There's a part for a door there, and here now it just leads to nothing. I mean, I got a midpoint. Let's check it out! Hey, oh no, wait, there is stuff here, but that I cannot do anything about. Interesting. Fascinating. Sleepy. <laughs> so, this is- oh, hi. Check it. Alright, so, okay. I get to have my very own poison. Strictly speaking, you can go here to return to prime reality. And you can get yourself at least a mushroom that way. You could do it twice to get yourself two power-ups too. But for now, I'll content myself with you. Because actually, this is where it trails off. I just want to see. Yeah, there's a floor there you can just kind of blindly fall at, but afterward there's just nothing. Uh, this looks like a slight nightmare. Variation on a nightmare. By... Alan Rinsky, a new artist I just invented. Yeah, this is that. Uh, okay. Make sure, like, your everything's timed well. There you go, and this is Golden Door. It's Golden Door. It's like the other place, except now there's not a red pipe over it. So it is... Is this God that I'm witnessing? Is this what it's like? Oh wow, you gotta jump on this while it's in midair. That's not easy. <laughs> um. Okay. Finally earning that five stars of yours. Uh, yeah, I'm not. What's the best? What? Yeah. Uh. Oh, 
All right. I'm sure I can probably recreate <laughs> recreate that. Wait a second, there's a wall up there. I think I need to go the other way. That's solid. That's not solid. Oh, alright, so then I will go here then, if you don't mind. Yo, where am I going? Oh no. <laughs> what is this? Hi. Yeah, you're you're wanted here. filter there. Hey. So I am wondering if you do want the golden statue down here, though. Would it make it anything easier? I don't think it'll make it any easier. Mm. Well, I might have summoned them. Yeah, see, the thing I don't like is how he's just... Hi. Oh, way back, maybe? Yeah, I'm not sure what I'm doing here. Like, the why of what we're doing here. Like, I mean, I'm going here because this is where the level's leading me, and obviously this is not meant to be done by any kind of human. Check it out, it's me, the Mario Man, twirling around his fantasies. Constantly about to get hit by Tin Man. He's a big old pile of leaves. Big old pile of leaves. Don't get any use of those. Sweet, just sitting there on invisibility there. Right? Is that supposed to happen? Is that a feature? Do I go here or there? Well, I saw fire bouncing, so... Oh, sweet lord banana. I want to fall maybe in the other hole. I have no idea. I have so many no ideas. It's incredible. Alright, but what I did learn is that it is worth it to take the time to get both power-ups. It's like, we even get this? Oh, what's this? Oh, well, hello there. Down there's another portal of death and doom. So yeah, there might be something about getting a P-switch somewhere. A story about a P-switch, some really bad stories for really bad people. This is real hard. This part, like, I, I, it's real hard. What's down here? Hey, hey, hey. Sweet little coin block maze. Truly the best that we could find. Sweet little coin block maze. Nothing good except that thing. Wait, but you need to be big to be able to go out. Unless there's coins there to help me out. Can I despawn you something? Let me just sneak underneath you. Okay. Great. Fantastic. Truly marvelous engineering. So, what's the power up here? Oh, feather? Huh, I wonder how doable it is to just kind of fly up here. Because of the really fast one? Wow, that was a waste of perfectly good feather, though. So, well, by, by doing this, though... Man, right after I get out how to do the thing, too, anyways. Is 
is that, yeah, now I can kind of carve my way out. I mean, I'm still gonna die. But we're all gonna die. So, what do I do with this? Since I do... Ooh, have this weird random way back, I want to check out what's in that evil TV here. Like, why is that there? You're clearly getting... Like, but that could be a trap, and it's just a- Oh boy, you wasted your stuff. It's possible. I don't know. I'm in an alternate chimney universe. So you have to come back big. Okay. Wait, am I stuck? Because then I'm gonna return back to the- Now I'm in the prime universe. So now I'm returning to the alternate universe, and because I'm trapped and I have to kill myself with spikes. So you need to get in here... big. Which brings you here in the real world... Which I guess would let you go... back... where there's the big red pipe? Because the only way you can carry st ah, man. This is getting complicated. Because the only way you can carry stuff through screens... ...is through a pipe entrance. So that would explain why there's that big red pipe at the start of the prime version of the... ...of the Thwimp Zone. Alright. Something is somethinging. So yeah, so you, I need to keep my big. That whole reason that thing is there... Man, knowing that I'm not allowed to take damage. Okay, now I can just kind of go with this guy here. Hopefully, the other guy didn't return. I have to deal with fire, which is the stupid part. Alright, so far so good. Yo, alright, so. Go into the Prime Universe. Is there anything over on their end of that? Like, it looks... I don't know, man. God dang, it, Like, there's a photo just kind of bouncing there. Oh, but I can't scroll the screen over there. So, there is nothing there. Alright. So here it's just... has to be a more comfortable way of doing that, but whatever. See, that's what I meant. Got hurt in a dumb way. It happens. This brings us here. Back here. Where do I use this? Maybe that's how you got the dragon coin without killing yourself? I don't know where to use this. So I guess I'm just gonna... Oh. Is that where I want to get it? There's a blue door here, just for me. So I gotta redo the first half again. That's all. <laughs> and then back. That's all. I think, like, I might be misunderstanding things. But... Alright, so... I guess I'll just leave this here. Because it shouldn't despawn. And let's redo this, I guess. No, but I can't, because this is in the way. Is there another switch somewhere? Yeah, that's locked off. I can't return there. Because 
that switch, so... Anything. There seems to be like any bridges or anything. I'm. utterly lost. Yeah, there's nothing here. Where's that switch? So! One more thing to consider. At the end of that place with the statues and all that, there is a green pipe I've never been into. So, like, I, I was doing all this because it's the most complicated action. Let's get the P-Switch and go in the green pipe instead. We'll see what happens there. What's wrong with you, statue? What? Oh, sweet. Invisible maze. Really? Uh, alright. So, this is getting better. Where do I go? Oh, down here. Uh, you know what? It's okay. I'll take the hit, I guess. So, this brings us to. Now we're on this side. I mean, I remember seeing that. So, that, that did nothing? Awesome. Good use of everyone's time right there. Start over! There was a mushroom there all this time. On the evil side. Oh. There's a door here, too. Alright. Oh, there's a switch. That's pretty cool. A feather. Where will this door lead? I don't know. Two feathers. What does that mean? So I hit the switch. Now I'm in the evil side. With the switch pressed. So now I have to redo everything, but I go back through the weird tunnel. Wow, you literally have to do the level twice. Well, this half twice. Of course, it gives you double feathers, so I guess it's a little bit easier. Then again, I'm not used to the timing of these with feathers, so... I guess we'll see how that goes. But it's not starting out strong. Oh, boy, yeah... Yeah, I'm not used to this. Oh, man. But you have to do the level twice. Like, you literally just... Like, Mario's laughing to the bank, saying, hey... Yeah, the capes are not very useful because I'm not used to doing these with a cape and it changes everything. Here I'm used to flying and I completely lost the timing. And I need to remain big though because, oh boy, well, you know what? I'm probably gonna hit a failure state here. Because as soon as I lose my hit by bigness, it's, it's all gone. It's all over. Uh... There's nothing guaranteed in this universe about flaring Guidus. And there you go. I've lost it. Now I cannot go through the thing. Like, I did the hard parts, but I can't go through the thing. And I jumped in a fire somehow, regardless.
I don't like your attitude, sir. Still, still got a mushroom. Alright, now I should get that boss door. Not covered in switch blocks. Yo, I wonder what's gonna be the surprise. It's... Wendy, why do you have a portal in the middle of the room that's going to ruin everything if I touch it, I'm certain? You really, like, should consider just hiring a decorator at this point, Wendy. Every time I visit you, you have some new weird horror show on display, and I just... I'm just kind of worried about you at this point a little bit. Like, do you have... S is it stress? Are you overworked? Is there anything you want to talk about, Wendy? I timed out. Okay. Great. I didn't notice, because it changed the time to a smaller time. I didn't hear the siren, right? Spilled <sighs> the stoop. of you. seconds. Okay. So, you need to get in there. Wow, I didn't even damage her. I'm glad I could damage her here. Oh, then she was on the other side of the screen. Now she is inside the screen. Come on, Wendy, be nice. You were nice. I appreciate it when you're nice, Wendy. Oh, yeah, I'm sure the TV still kills you. I guess it could be a timer reset, but I'm not gonna check. I'm not going to find out. Holy moly, macaroni. And that's a preview of what World 7 is gonna look like. The sand fall in the background sure has gone real dark. I guess it's nighttime. Now that he's defeated the seven Kooplings, Mario begins his invasion in the Valley of Bowser. However, little did he know that it's only just begun. The real High Mari presents Hyper 6 starts here. Yeah, it's gonna be behind the sand. It's gonna, yeah, it's gonna. That's pretty cool. Like that's legit rad. The star is less rad. It'd be more rad if you just like walk through it. I know I didn't lose- I only lost 25 lives, but holy cow, this took a long time. <laughs> what a- Like, it's just arbitrarily make you redo the second half twice. That's just- Like, that- that takes guts. That- that takes- That takes daring, if nothing else. 